hey my friends it's Katherine in this video I'm going to continue using the same pattern pack of paper that I've been using for the last few videos in the very first one I made these cards with a frame die and I had the inside of the frame cut out and I just put it to the side because I knew I was going to figure out how to use it and so that's what I'm going to be doing on today's video Now in my first video I used these two frame dies. These are from the die collection that was in the stamp of approval Young at Heart back in February and I made these two cards here and then I was left over with all these inside pieces. So I'm going to take one of them and cut it. <laughs> so it's four by three. So we'll cut it at two and then we'll turn it and cut it at one and a half. So now you have the four pieces cut and we're just going to turn over two of them and then adhere them to a card layer. So I'm going to have to play with this one and make a card out of this one too, but this is what I've got going on so far. I really love this paper pack with crumb cake and I have some blue cardstock to go with it and now I have to figure out how to decorate the rest of it. So I thought it would be fun to do a vellum. This is vellum cardstock by Stampin' Up and I just cut out a leaf die. Now I have a circle die cut. Cut out, I'm just going to adhere it down, tack it down so it doesn't move onto my Misty, and I'm using Wheat Wreath by Casual Fridays, and I'm going to do Grateful for You. I'm positioning the Grateful where I want it stamped. I probably could do this with just regular um, block, but my Misty was sitting right here, so we'll use it. I'm going to add just a little liquid glue onto the leaf. We'll add it here. We might see some of that glue through and I can add some sequins to cover it. I have the Grateful For You with a couple little hearts on there. So I just added a few sequins and I'm all done. Hope you guys are inspired to cut up that pattern paper and make some fun cards with it. I have more up my sleeve, so I'm not done with this pattern paper pack yet. Be sure to stay tuned and also to hop over to Stamp Nation to see more and my blog because I, well, I got to finish this up, right? So I'm guessing that I will finish this up and there'll be photos on my blog. Thanks for being here. Subscribe if you haven't already. Give me a thumbs up if you like this and I'll see you soon.